Hello YouTube, this is Sonic to KK here, and today we are back for another uh, Love 2D Lua programming tutorial, and I have been messing about with the numbers uh, in the math that random calculation, like, so much, and after eventually like, thinking, I worked out what it is, it's hard to explain what was going on, uh, what I think was going on, but I think I fixed it, I just set it to 500, look at that! Just as I said it. It's not working. It's not working. Anyway. Anyway. Here is a list of what I plan to do. Tailed maps, eventually. Well, as a, well, a, ta a tailed map. Collision detection with tail. That's going to be a lot of fun. Scores we've done. High scores we've done. Player we've done. Player image. Have a look, actually. We need to add that. Uh, high scores, player, player image. We need another player image. Uh, food, food image. We want a food image. Uh, GUI system with love frames. Use of lovely moon. Again, the love to the forms called David Obot. I think it's or David. I, I just call him David. Uh, he's awesome. And he made the lovely moon library. And it is for states. Uh, and you can have like stackable states where you can have multiple uh, states in one. It'll be useful. It'll give you more advanced control over states. Uh, possible use of HS2. That is a high score high score table library. A camera, either a camera module or a camera or the hub camera or love that graphics to translate or something. Uh, score popping out as you get food. I think I talked about this already. I want this multiple food things yet yeah. fix that annoying spawning bug which is uh, that bug that we saw spreadsheet animation using animal we're definitely gonna use that for our player probably gonna have him, like have his mouth open and close as he moves uh, maybe maybe a particle system and a custom font. Uh, I think what we're going to work on in this tutorial though is getting a custom font, so I will be right back and get a custom font. Okay, so this is one of my favourite sites for getting fonts. Uh, I just go look here and uh, look for some fonts. So maybe a cartoon font is I think what we would want. Orange juice, I actually use that in some of my stuff. Uh... No, we don't want that one. I don't know why I can click on. Uh, no, we don't want that font. We don't want the Pokemon font. We don't want that. We don't want the Mickey font. That one looks kind of nice. Uh, it takes ages to find a good font, so I'm just going to look for one. Be right back. So, I found this font, Curse Casual. Uh, just go to the font, dafont.com, and look for this. Uh, always, always, I'm just going to put a disclaimer here. I, uh, if you download a font off this website and get a virus, I don't think the font take any uh, heat for it, and I don't. I certainly don't take any heat for it. Like it's it's all your fault because you downloaded the font. But I don't think you'll get a virus. But just a disclaimer in case you do, which you probably won't. But just it's not my fault if you do. Oh, and it's probably not the font that comes from. But I'm not gonna make decisions for them. But yeah, I like this font. It supports like almost all the characters uh, that I need, except like these two, which I don't need. But it was these ones. Well, I don't need these ones. I would just need really that one and that one that I needed. The love O, just in case we ever want to use it. Um. So yeah, I'm going to download it. It is a free font. Uh, hold on, who made it? This guy. Full credit goes to this guy. Full credit. I did not create this font. I did. I'm. I'm just simply downloading it and using it. So, uh, save it to the desktop. And 
Well, I can just minimize this because it's not needed for right now. Uh, so we're going to unzip this. I'm going to install the font. You do not need to install the font, but I'm going to install it because I want to. Of course, casual I mean, it only has the regular. And then what we're going to have to do is uh, go to programming or wherever you saved it. I saved mine in Fun with Love, YouTube, YouTube tutorials. And I'm going to make a new file and call it fonts. Actually, while I'm here, why not make IMG SMX and sort it. This is going to be for later whenever we have audio and we have images. So we're going to put my fonts in here into this folder. And fonts are there. This is where our fonts are. Uh, oh crap. Wrong one. Put it in there. There we go. Our font is in there. Now remember, cursecasual.ttf. That is important. So in Love 2D, uh, to load a font, uh, you need to load a font and you need to set a font. When you load it, you're just loading it into memory. Uh, and when you set it, you are setting the font that you want. If you have like several files, you might want to set a different font. Like you might want to set uh, the default love font for something, but then you might want to set our custom font for something else. And so on. So what we're going to do here is we're going to load the font and just say font. Uh, 20 equals, no, no, I'm so used to Java, equals love dot graphics dot set font, and this sets the font, so you need to give it the file path to the font, which in our case is font slash curse casual dot ttf. I don't know if you can load bitmap fonts or F F O N or FNT files into uh, Love 2D. You might have to ask on the Love forums about that. Uh, personally, I would use TTFs. I prefer them. And to be honest, FNT files are like nightmare. They are nightmare. Oh, I hate them. Anyway, this loads the font in the memory. And why do I call it font 20? Because it's going to be our font and it's going to be 20 pixels. Now, if you wanted to just accept the font, you can just give it uh, uh, the uh, integer value or the number value of 20 and that would set the size uh, so this or no it's new font is what we want that's that font it's new font and then uh, here we do love that graphic that's set font font 20 and then if we build and run this. Oh fonts. Font s is what it was in that font. Silly me. And there we go, we have our custom font at twenty pixels. And then if we try to do this it still updates it. Oh wait, what happened to our high score? High score didn't save. It was wiped from last time. What the heck? That was strange. Mm. Anyway, that was strange. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Uh, yeah. Ooh. I don't know what caused that. If you know what caused it, leave a comment and uh, I will mention you in the next tutorial or something or other. Why did that go up there? I don't understand. Somebody. Please tell me why that went up there. But anyway, we've set our custom font here. Uh, I think it may have something to do with our font. Maybe let's try to change the font says. No. Maybe 2070-ish would be better. Yeah, I like that. Nice and big. Uh, yeah, that's all for this tutorial. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like and don't forget to subscribe for more awesome content. Uh, my name is Sonic2KK and I will see you in the next tutorial.